Hey, Teddy. You said that this place is reality for people who enter, right? So that shopping district and the weird room we saw before? Did they exist because the ones who died entered this world and it became their reality? I guess what I'm trying to ask is, did those places form because of the people who entered this world? I don't know, but that's probably where they were when the shot... The fog does lift here sometimes. I always get so scared I have to hide. I sensed people here twice before. So let's get this straight. Senpai and that Yamano, after a while, that shadow thing came out. Does that sound right? So if I'd been here until the fall. Yeah, you were lucky. Sensei and me were- Damn it. Senpai and that announcer. They were stuck here all alone. Yosuke. They disappeared when the fog lifted. But they were safe before that. They attacked us. Maybe they're keeping a close eye on us. They might see people who investigate this place. It'll be dangerous. But we might be able to fight them. Are you saying if anyone else gets thrown in here, like how you guys just saved me? Anyways, we need to catch the one who's throwing people in here and make him... Yeah. Um, can I ask something too? If shadows are born from humans, what... W you don't even know where you came from? How should we know? I know some things, most, to be honest. Are you no wonder we couldn't get... You'll... Well, you're the one who said you weren't letting us out unless... Oh, that's right. Okay, I'll be... You need to come in from the same place every time, so we can meet up. from s you might show up somewhere got well pretty much all right can you show us the way right cool okay go 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 ah uh, haste That might have kind of sort of been our fault. Maybe we did go a little... Let's apologize to her. I'm completely... I think... Hmm? Oh, are you surprised to see... Um... I'm glad to hear that. It must be difficult moving to a place you know nothing about. I've never been out of Inaba, so I would- Oh! Are you getting along with Chie? I see. She's a- Chie's very supportive, you know? It's always- We had homeroom together last year, too, and I still remember- Oh, I should get going. I Our inn can't function without me right now. Um, I'll see you at school. Dad's late. Our next story is an update in our... At around 7 a.m., local high school students, since the body was positioned similarly, police are proceeding under the assumption that the coroner's report has established Miss Konishi's time of death and the body went unnoticed until this morning as a result of the heavy fog blanketing the air. Another incident. Dad won't be... I'll be okay. Can you help me do... 
Amagi Inn, located upstream of Samegawa River, is the town's oldest his Vacationers are known to travel surprise. After the incident with Miss Yamano, the manager has stepped aside. Le In other words, she's a manager who... Now that has a nice ring to it. Hmm? We've heard that you're the new man... Oh, well... Someday, though. That aside... Huh? This is bo- Oh. In other Inaba-related news, meteorologists are predicting heavy fog throughout the year. The region has seen an abnormal amount of fog over the past few years, and the cause of the climate change is unknown. Whatever the reason, residents of the Inaba area should be extra careful. Our broadcast tonight was extended to bring you up-to-date news on the incident in Inaba. Welcome. Do not be alarmed. You are fast asleep in the real world. I have summoned you within your dreams. And so we meet again. This is a space that only those who have, in one way or another, entered into a contract may enter. In your daily life, you subconsciously heard the call to awaken, and you chose to follow the destiny of your inner voice, thereby enacting your glorious awakening to your power. Hold on to this. From this night forth, you are our guest in this velvet room. Your destiny will require you to hone your power. And for that, you will inevitably require our help. There is but one prize for this assistance. You must abide by your contract and assume responsibility for all decisions you may make. Very well. The persona you have acquired it is a side of you that shows itself when you face the world around you. Perhaps you can think of it as a facade of determination you wear to face various difficulties in life. Your persona ability, however, is that of the wild card. Compared to that of others, it is very special. It is like the number zero, empty, yet holding infinite potential within itself. The persona ability is the power to control one's own heart. And the heart is strengthened through bonds. As you form bonds by becoming involved with others, your own social links will gradually develop. The power of these social links is what will determine your persona's abilities. Social links are necessary for more than strengthening your persona. At times, they will help light the way to the truth you're searching for. Where will your awakened power of the wild card take you? I look forward to traveling the road of your destiny together. Till we meet again.
Yo! You saw what was on last night, right? I couldn't tell who it was, but if someone's shown up on TV, we can't ignore it. Let's go check it out after school. Maybe Teddy can tell us something. If it turns out someone was thrown in again, there really might be a culprit behind all that. Even if it is something about that place that's killing the victims. If someone's using that world as a weapon, that's unforgivable. We need to find the culprit, no matter what it takes. There's no way the police can do it. Who'd believe that the murderer kills people by throwing them into the TV? Totally. A promise is a promise. You know, I tried sticking my head in the TV last night the way you did, and it actually worked. I think I can do that now because I have the same power. Persona, wasn't it? could be that we got this gift from someone specifically so we could solve the case. Then again, you managed to go inside the TV and get your persona first. I feel like as long as you're with me, I can find the culprit and crack this case. Well, let's do our best. Persona ability is the power to control one's own heart. And the heart is strengthened through bond. As you form bonds by becoming involved, the power of... Um, about yesterday? Never mind that. Huh? Y Yukiko-san? Oh, man. What should I know? All that about how people showing up on the... Oh, we were just talking about that. We're thinking of... The person on TV yesterday? That kimono looked like the one she wears at the inn and she wore it during that interview. I got worried. I called her earlier in the evening, though, and she said she'd be at... I... Calm down. We get the picture. No. What's that supposed to mean? We don't know yet for sure. We should check to see if she... Give her an... No! She, she's not in! Are you serious? S stop it! Something must have come up! She might be help Yeah, but would she skip school for that? Well, I'll get Come on, you Oh, uh -huh. oh uh, no. <sighs> She was over at the inn. She said they had a big group reservation and she had yeah. Oh, she said she'll be at For crying out loud, she was told and you were all <laughs> Sorry, but there is a reason. Oh, yeah? Well, we thought people show up on the Midnight Channel because they're already over. I mean, it makes sense, right? People show up. But Yukiko-san's still here in our world. All right, let's meet up at Juneth. Okay, I think that's more. If I hadn't seen the place firsthand, I'd never have believed a story like that. Yeah, no kidding. Anyways, we need to know what's going on inside. Yeah. Too bad there's so many customers around. I forgot there's a sale in the electronics department today. How? By talking to that Teddy guy? I got it. Come here a sec. Try sticking your hand in and calling him over. I bet that bear's wandering around the entrance anyway. 
Hey, Chia, stand over here. Make a wall with me. A wall? It's not a game. Can you? Who's anyone? I'm a lonely little bear like always. This land feels so barren. I'm gonna go warn Yukiko anyway. Since she'll be busy this weekend helping out at the inn, I doubt she'd go anywhere alone, but... Yeah. You'll walk with her to school on Monday, right? I'll go pick her up at her house. Maybe we'll find out more on tonight's Midnight Channel. Cross your fingers that this is all just a misunderstanding. What's your cell number? I'll, I'll call you when I watch it tonight. to watch tonight. Looks like we found all we're gonna find here. And we've still got nothing that points directly to a suspect. We don't even know if this is a homicide. Well, what else could it be? There's no way a body could end up like that by accident. <sighs> I know. We haven't found the cause of death for the first Vic. Now we got a second one just like it. If this is a murder case, there's no doubt we're dealing with a single... But if that's true... What the hell is going on? You know... I thought at first this all spun out of that love trap. No, that singer, Misuzu Hiragi. And remember, the only reason the scandal went public was because Hiragi herself broke it to the media. No one would put themselves under suspicion that way if they had murder on their mind. Got a point there. Same with Taro Namatame, her husband. No matter how much we shake him down, nothing links him to the murders. He's been working in the city for the past six months. Seems he was here recently because of the scandal, but he was swamped with work back home. There are eyewitnesses and other evidence placing him at... And we can't find anything that shows Yamano making contact with Namatame before... You hear Namatame's career has also been killed stone dead? He's been fired from his position as secretary. He's practically as much of a victim as the Yamano girl. Yeah, I agree. Then we have the second case. She's the one who discovered Yamano's corpse. But I don't buy the killer shutting her up as... She was killed well after she reported the body, and the culprit didn't hide her. It's like they were meant to be found. The only other connection is that she attended the same school as the daughter of the... But that hardly points to a motive. And coincidences like that are common in a town as small as ours. Yeah, I heard about that angle on the news, too. What? Is the story about the inn out already? Okay, I got it. Maybe there was something about the corpse that only Saki Konishi knew. And our perp killed her to keep whatever it was. <sighs> Either way, all we can do now is keep our perp. It has to be someone in Inaba. Oh, is your detective's intuition at work?
thing. Tonight, Princess Yukiko has a big surprise. I'm gonna go score myself a hot stud. Welcome to Not a Dream, Not a Hoax. Princess Yukiko's hunt for her Prince Charming. And I keep prepared. I've got my lacy unmentionables on, stacked from top to bottom. I'm out to catch a whole harem, and the best of the lot is gonna be all mine. Well, here I go. up early so I woke up with him he said he's gonna be are you going I'll be fine by myself so the weather this weekend as for next week oh the sun's gonna come out uh weren't Sorry for the holdup. I found some stuff we can use in the closet at home. Take a look at these. We've got our persona, so... Ah, you've got discerning taste. The blades... as... kind of like this? Or like this? What about this? Two suspicious young males found. One arm. Huh? No, 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 no. This, this is... I guess that's not... We're just two ordinary kids who like weapons. Put the weapons down now. Hands where I can see... But, but... Are you resisting an office... You didn't seem the type to pull a st You know what's been going on around- For God's sake. You're lucky I was around. We're sorry. Wait, so the one that disappeared is the Amagi girl? Seems like it. That she's just a high schooler, you know? Could be that she decided to run away from home. Hey, did he say- Hmm? Who's what now? Oh- I'm sure you've seen on the news that there's an investigation in front. You're free to go. Whoa, pardon me. Huh? Aren't you the kid staying at Dojima-san's place? Oh, uh, can we ask you something? It's about Yukiko-san. I mean, Yukiko Amagi of the Amagi... Did something happen? Huh? Oh. Um. Well, if you're friends with Miss Amagi, we got a call from Miss Amagi's parents. Yeah. Since it was the weekend, the workers at the inn. Oh, but that doesn't necessarily. But people have been turning up dead on foggy days. By the way, did she say in? Uh. Well, that announcer, Miss Yam. This Anne. By the way, did Miss Amagi ever hint that she might be leaving the house? Because if not, there's been some theories floating around that... Ah, crap. 
but... Adachi, what the hell are you chatting with civvies for? And where's my cop? Sorry. Psst, forget I... Hey, does that detective think that Yukiko-san... Uh, well, there was a sl Anyway, something- Huh? I kept calling her, so I went to her house, and it- I guess we've got no choice but to go now. But that aside, the cops are saying some weird stuff. Apparently, Yukiko-san's mom collapsed because that announcer lady bit- They think that gives her a motive. And the fact that the announce- What? They think Yukiko did it? Dude, don't snap it! Yukiko's the victim here, damn- y You're right. But the police totally- I'm going to. And that's final. I'm going to save Yukiko. Are you going to be a... Man, they just confis... Weapons? Come on. Here we are. Uh, metalworks, I guess? Doesn't that seem weird to you? Why would you know about a place like this anyway? Oh, I get it. You watch one. It's not that at all. I overheard some guys in our class. Here, this one. But it might be too heavy. I don't know, Chie. I still think it's too dangerous. You don't. You don't know shit about how I feel. You I'm going, and that's that. Be listen, you don't know what it's like in there. If you're not gonna listen to our warning, if you insist on coming, just make sure. All right. Man, what should we get? Hey, mind picking out something for me too? You're our main asset in battle right now. I got my stuff all picked up. You know, if we wear this stuff around town, but it's not like we can waltz into Juness with a sack full of gear. Why not conceal them under our uniforms? I don't think people would. Okay. All right, let's split up and get the store will be crowded until the. Then I'll see you guys at the Juness food court. If you'll give me a moment of your time. We have been expecting you. The catastrophe that has headed your way. It has already taken human lives in its approach towards you.
But you have nothing to fear. You already have the power to fight against it. It seems that the time for you to use your persona has come. <laughs> your persona ability is that of the wild card. If you strengthen your bonds properly, our role is to... My country by me the when they the tome you see in my hand is the persona compendium registering the personas you hold will allow you to recall them at any time please see me when you wish to use oh and one more i would like to introduce a new resident of the velvet Marie? <sighs> yeah, I can hear. Nice and... Excuse her soul. Shut up. Don't... As you... She may be brusque at times, but please... Marie will be dealing with skill card. Using these cards will allow you to provide your... Also, I am sure she will help you form a bond between yourself. Marie will contact. Please feel free to speak with her here when you wish to use her services. <laughs> Do you recall my words to you before? The coming year is a turning point in your destiny. If the mystery goes unsolved, your future may be forever lost. I meant precisely what I said. Defeat in battle is... Please, when next we meet, you will come here of your own will. <laughs> I look forward to Until then. stick out. Guess it doesn't help that we're in our school uniforms on a Sunday. The sale should end soon, so that'll get rid of some of the people wandering around. Alright, let's get going. Gee, it's not... I'm going! Fine, but don't push yourself, got it? What are you doing? Can't you tell? I'm thinking about stuff. I've been deliberating over it for a long time now. Hey, that wasn't a bad joke. Uh, so, did you figure anything out? Uh, it's probably useless to think about it too much. I've seen the inside of your skull, and it was empty. How rude! You're right, though. I try and try, but nothing comes. Will you guys shut up? Listen. Some. Wow. There's a girl with a better nose than me. What's your name, Miss? M miss? Uh, I'm Chie, but never mind now. I think it happened a little after I talked with you guys. A is it Yukiko san? I, I don't. The presence is over that way. Over there? Is everyone. Yeah. You're positive that no one's behind a camera for that bizarre midnight program. Program? Maybe people on your side can see stuff in this world. And I told you before, there's only me and shadows here. There's no camera stuff going on. This world has been like this from the beginning. From the beginning? I don't know. Can you guys explain everything about your world? I've never seen this program... Well, is that really what's happening? Because the first time Yukiko showed up on that channel was before she disappeared. 
I mean, Yukiko, saying s Score? Stud? Yeah, I couldn't believe it either. Huh, I wonder. Is this kind of like what happened to me last... There's a lot of stuff I... St I think that program happens because of the person who appears on it. So... Yukiko is producing that show herself? Oh! Hey, do you feel you... I'm pretty sure. So, um, what's this... Yukiko's here. Hey, what... Jeez. Beat them up! You hit its weakness! Smart nice. move, Sensei! You hit its weakness! Should we All right! Out of our way! an enemy the seeds of possible Sensei's way!
for broke! That was a good one, nice Sensei! Move, partner! You hit its weakness! Let's okay! Go. Ready or not, here we go! Chie, are you all right? She said that red looks good. You can... I hated my name. Yukiko. Snow is cold and it melts quickly. It's transient, but it's perfect for me. Still... Is Yukiko-san's inner thoughts? Yeah, this castle is probably here. Chie was the only one who gave my life meaning. She's bright and strong compared to Chie and I. Chie is so kind. Yukiko, I. Chie is so kind, huh? What a joke. Just like Yosuke. She lost control over a suppressed self. Are, Are we, we talking, talking about, about that, Yukiko? <laughs> she, she says I'm protecting her. her. She, she says, says she's, she's worthless. That's how it should be, right? <laughs> Yukiko, so good looking. So fair of skin. So feminine. She's the one all the guys drool over. When you can tell looked at me with such jealousy, man, did I get a charge out of that? You can come the score. She can't do anything if I'm not around. I'm better than her. Much, much better. No! I've I've never thought that! What? to protect Chie-chan right now. No, don't come near me. Chie, calm down. No. Wait, stupid. Don't say anything else like that. <laughs> That's, That's right. right. I'm, I'm the one who can't do anything, anything alone. I can't win as a girl, let alone as a person. I'm pathetic. But you can go. She, she depends, depends on me. <laughs> That's, That's why she's my friend. friend. I'll, I'll never, never loosen my, my grip on her. No! That's not how I think of her! <laughs> so, <laughs> so you're just, just going to turn your back and deny me again? again? But the things are different now. When, when the time, time comes, I'll, I'll be the one left standing. standing. You won't be right. I'm still you. Shut up! Jin! to save 
Chief Chihachan!
Go. We're not gonna? What a waste. Yes! <laughs> 